these are people that are beyond annoying. Like at the at the airport, especially people are always in a hurry, or like people are walking around really fast. And I'm one of those people. Even though I, I do go like really early to the airport, I like to be in some sort of a pace, right? And these are people, when you go in the electric carpet walkers and they just literally take up the whole space, like the thing is probably what, like a meter and a half wide and they take up the whole Bags space. Bags everywhere. It's like, no, you're not supposed to take up the whole space. And first of all, those carpet walkers are not for you to stand there. Those things are there to help you walk faster. So if you, the fact that you're standing there just means you're lazy. And worse than those people are people that when you're walking behind somebody and they're walking at a good pace, they're like, okay, I'm just gonna follow this person around so that I don't have to get annoyed at other people. <laughs> but then they disappoint you and they just stop all of a sudden and stare at you know the screen where it got all the like times and gate numbers and all those things and they just stop and stare. Okay, I don't I don't want to be mean because I know this kind of things happen but then you always have that immature person or even like unorganized like some people they do know what's happening but they just unorganized like no it's like you're waiting for security and you're just not ready person like it's just there you have to put your stuff and there's like you have to take your phone and your jacket and sometimes your shoes depending on whatever you're wearing mm -hmm. and they're just not prepared and everyone is like waiting <sighs> Why can you not just prepare and take a liquid laptop? I'm just telling you what to do next time you go. <laughs> <laughs> These are people that are like beyond annoying. Show off people who would take pictures of themselves all the time and pictures of themselves with the planes in the background. People that take pictures of like, you know, they want to check in in like three different types of social medias and people that are like boarding passes uh, I mean do that in yeah. the corner like don't do it in the middle of the area where you're like blocking me or something I like that I love to show people where I travel and you know how I travel and things like that but I don't make it into like you know I don't check in myself in, in like three different social medias you know I just keep it keep it to the down low you know don't need to tell the whole world about it all the, all the time tell the whole world but not all the time <laughs> I love kids not saying anything, not telling anyone off, but it's just, it's really annoying when you're at the airport, you're tired, it's a long journey, everyone's tired, and there's this one kid, like making all the noise they can. I mean, how much sound is possible to come out of that person, like tiny person, but it's just annoying, and everyone cannot stand him, and the parents do nothing. They just sit there. They just sit there, literally. Parents said they cannot control their children. Kids that are running around everywhere, touching other people's things, and the parents literally cannot keep up their kids. <clears throat> so these are people, as soon as this announcement that, you know, your flight's about to board, these are the people that stand there, like, literally are like power walking in order to be the first ones on the line. And then they have to wait for like another half an hour still. And then, you know, when the, they, announce. they announce that, oh, only these seat numbers, please come board. And then you have people that are completely like way far off, like they're lining up and then they get rejected and get sent back. It's like one to 50. Okay, I'm 23, it's close enough. Not really. No, it's not. Okay, then you have the outlet horrors. <clears throat> like, let's just admit here that airports lack of like, Sockets. Like, there's no way that everyone can charge their things at the same time. That's never gonna happen. Mm. Then those annoying people who are actually staying overnight or something like that for long hours, and they want to take a nap. So let me just charge my phone and sleep over here, because that's the right thing to do, right? And don't let anybody else charge your phones. I mean, come on. Sometimes people have emergency. That's why they have the sockets there from in the first place not for you to charge it so you can like instagram later these are usually kids or sometimes adults that play games on their like ipads or phones whatever without headphones on and especially kids games have this really loud like bring extra pairs of headphones i'm pretty sure they're not that expensive just make a kid wear them and like that will all be happy and those adults that watch movies without headphones on like seriously, you're an adult, I'm sure you can understand when other kids do it and you feel annoyed So don't do it to other people And you are a full grown adult that should not be doing that 